What's up guys? So we're talking more about iPhone 7, obviously, because it's really the only thing that I care about talking about. <laughs> Everyone said, Justine, where's all of your cooking videos and vlogs and everything else? I don't know, they'll be back once the iPhone's out. Some of the questions that I've been getting from you guys is, is mostly concerns about how are you going to listen to music while charging your phone. It's an issue, it really, really is. But there are solutions, don't worry. We'll take a look at some of the cases that Apple has to offer, we'll look at some headphone options, and then we're gonna dive in to Amazon and see what they've got. I've yet to even click through since the announcement to see if they've added anything else. Some of it's probably fake and not even real and they're just labeling it iPhone 7, so I'm excited to see what we can see. Let's first check out Apple's site here. So clearly the first thing that Apple is pushing is the AirPods, not even available yet. So I tried to even order them that night when I did the pre-order for the iPhone, which was a complete disaster. Please raise your hand or leave me a comment in the comments below if you guys did not have a, a hot mess of a disaster trying to order at midnight. It happens every time. You'd think they'd have it figured out, but I think they actually do have it figured out and they strategically make it so we can't actually order it. Or maybe that's what they want us to think and they actually do have problems. I'm not sure. And of course they're pushing their Beats gross headphones, which we will not even address them, so. The iPhone 7 smart battery case. My sister had this, she liked it. I have a lot of friends that have this. I would love to have one as well, but they don't make it for the iPhone 7 Plus, so please, I made the mistake of ordering this and not reading. I just got so excited the day that it was launched. Back when they had it for the iPhone 6, and I failed to realize that, oh, it's a little bit smaller than my current phone. So Jenna had the iPhone 6 small, so she used it for a really long time and is basically just like their silicon cases, just with a little bump on it, which is a battery charger. And it's cool because it does connect through the lightning port and it'll give you notifications right on your home screen saying, hey, your case is 100% full, your phone is 90% full, so it'll kind of shut off and turn off when you actually need it, so that's kind of cool. Here's one of the lightning iPhone docks, which I have used in the past. I used to have one right next to my nightstand. Also do have an audio out, so if you're having sort of that dilemma of, okay, I wanna charge my phone and listen to music, you can get one of these where you can have an audio out so you can uh, connect that to speakers or something like that. So that's a super simple solution if you wanna plug in your phone, charge it, and listen to music. This is not a mobile solution though. This is one of those, I'm gonna put this on my desk and then plug it into a speaker. So this is definitely not something that you wanna take with you on road trips or maybe on an airplane. Not really the best idea, but it comes in a bunch of different colors to match your phone. Let's take a look at some of their cases. So I'm such a fan of the silicon cases. I have them in almost every color. Not every color, but my favorite colors. One of the huge updates that I am so excited about is Apple finally fixed the biggest problem with their white cases. Usually if you get a white case, you want it to be super slick and really, really just nice and white. But they had this huge black Apple logo on the back. Like This is crazy. Make it a little bit lighter. So I'm very appreciative that Apple listened to probably a lot of consumer feedback, mine included. They made the Apple logo much lighter. The first version of this, when they first came out, the Apple logo was actually white, so it was just a nice little outline, which was really perfect. I wonder if they're gonna do bumpers for the new phones. That's gonna be interesting to see if they do. Here's all the leather colors. Not a big fan of the leather cases. It's really probably just a preference. They do get a little bit scratched, I've found. They've got a lot more options for the iPhone 7 than the iPhone 7 Plus, so that's interesting, probably because no one was 100% sure if they were going to have that dual camera. It was almost pretty much confirmed. This looks cool. I don't think I want that. <laughs> this is something that everyone is really looking forward to this 3.5 millimeter headphone jack adapter. So if you really have no idea how this works, you plug this into your phone and you plug your headphones into here. Quite simple. Oh, I wish they'd quit pushing all their Beats paraphernalia in my face. Let's get to Amazon now. Bose wireless headphones. Let's see what they've got. I've yet to try these, but I did just get a pair of, they're their purple sport version, and of course it does have the 3.5 millimeter jack, mostly because I needed something to keep at my desk, so whenever I'm working, I love using these. They're pretty much my favorite. The Bose SoundSport wireless headphones in black and aqua. Here's a nice alternative to Beats by Dre. Beats by, no. So here's the problem with these. For me personally, these don't work that well in my ears. I'm trying to see if I can show you the difference here. So these ones don't have that little kind of nub sort of thing. Maybe my ears are weird, I'm not sure. 
I know a lot of you guys, I've seen it in the comments that you also have trouble with headphones. So these ones don't really work as well, at least for me personally. But the best part about this is you can get replacement ones. So <laughs> I'm using my webcam and this doesn't, this isn't really high quality. But if you can see, this is the one that I'm showing you on the screen. Just the one on the screen is in black. And these are one of the replacement ones that you can get. So it's a different type of mold. These are like $2 on Amazon as a replacement and they come with three different sizes. So you can always save those if you need a backup. So these I actually haven't tried yet, but I would imagine if they are just as good as these guys, then I definitely recommend it. Let me know if you guys have any recommendations that I should either try or you have any recommendations for anybody else watching this video. Leave those comments below. Six hours of battery per charge. These ones are an extra hour more than the Apple version of the AirPods. I do like that these have a wire on them because at least I won't just lose one. If I lose them, I lose both. I'd rather lose both than just lose one because then it's like, what do I do with this? Here's some of the quiet comfort headphones. These ones are the over the ear version. iPhone 7 accessories. Let's see what kind of crazy stuff they have on Amazon. Super slim and lightweight crystal clear protective cover. This is all, look at this Bluetooth headset. What is this? The heck is this? It's $19. <laughs> it looks really classy. Great color options. <laughs> Foldable Bluetooth keyboard. This is definitely something that's necessary. I definitely need this. Can you imagine what a crazy person I'd look like? I'm like, oh, hold on, I'm on, my, I'm on the airplane. I unfold my keyboard so that I can start texting. It's actually kind of a cool idea. Even though it's just, it seems very silly. I'll get it. This is a cool car mount. What's this thing? What a cool idea. God, I love the internet. Two angles, same comfort. Won't stick to leather dashboards. Ever wanted your car mounts to get great at your car? The stealth car mount has style and character that's easy to use. Leather mounts? <laughs> this is so silly. Not your phone one hand. I'm a little disappointed with all the things on Amazon because I thought we were going to get like some crazy and cool and wild things. But there's really not much at all. I'll put a link in the description of some of the items that I mentioned here if you guys are interested in checking those out. I really want to know from you guys though, what are your favorite things that you have been using? I'm pretty brand loyal so I don't usually stray too far from the things that I know that I really like. So if you guys have any suggestions that are really, really cool, I'd much rather take your suggestions than just kind of I try something at random and then it sucks. So I'll see you guys soon. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video. Let me know if there's any videos that you'd like to see me make about the iPhone or anything in general. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye. I agree. Hurry up, I need to go shopping. I have to go to the mall.